Hey, hey, folks. Comedians opening cards, no coffee. Comedians opening cards, no, no coffee. coffee. <laughs> oh. No coffee. Episode one. Here we are with Namjang Pucks. Ugly Buddha. Ugly television. But that's not what you're watching, because you're watching the tube and you're watching a great show. And you're gonna see comedians that you know and you don't, and you're gonna love it and it's fun. This is James Matter's uh, episode. Because he did Dallas and he's got a special called uh, Check Spot. You should check him out. Uh, He's just fantastic. Um, you may not know who he is, and you are missing out. James Mattern. Mattern. Big pattern, but with a goddamn M. And you, like, you do the freaking, like, what is it called? You, what do you, you're like fast on your feet, you like open? I, I love, I love, What's that yeah. called? I'm a host. You're the host, I'm and you have- I wrecked James Mattern years ago there. Yeah. Really? Because she was like, I need a host. And uh, Best I was like, James Mattern. And this is like so long ago. And she was like, huh? And Ryan Hamilton and Nikki Glazer were at the table, and they were like, "Yes, James oh. Matter." And like Nikki goes, "Best host in the city." And I was yeah, like, nah, "I love good. James." He I did warm up for my HBO. He oh, just, uh, there you I go. just I, he he can just go. Like and his energy is he so doesn't positive. have to stop talking. Yeah, right, he can just go. And you have that special you, you just did, which was the check spot. The check spot. Wait, and you you said you're gonna have another one soon. Something's coming soon, but there's uh, some real chat going on. So let's see. Okay, so, so what are we doing? This here? is called comedians opening car opening cards, no coffee. So there's a bunch of cards on the ground. Uh, they're old things. So pick something out if you want. And tell me why you picked that one and talk about. I'm gonna go with Dallas. Dallas is a good one. Because when I was a uh, uh, first year of college, they played it on TNN, and I watched it, and the first two years was fucking good, and it allowed me to talk to my aunts. And look at the opening one. Look at the opening card. This is when JR gets fucking shot. That was he the who shot whacked. JR, he and that was like the biggest, um, what was that called? Like, where the cliffhanger, cliffhanger before, the th before the next season. Who's it? It was the cliffhanger that captivated the nation. The third season of the hit drama Dallas ended with J.R. Ewing shot by an unknown assailant. The show's producers had no idea the cliffhanger would become a worldwide phenomenon. That summer, Hagman, as J.R., appeared on magazine covers, t-shirts, even beer cans. Vegas started taking bets. Even British royals were intrigued. We were presented to the Queen Mother, and she says, I don't suppose you could tell me who shot Jay off. I said, no, ma'am, not even you. <laughs> when the episode titled, Who Done It, finally aired, 83 million Americans, a then record 76% of the TV audience, tuned in for the big reveal. In the election that year, 85 million people. Two million more people voted, but that's it. The shooter was Kristen Shepard, JR's conniving sister-in-law and former mistress, played by actress Mary Crosby. It was amazing. This is the dad. I forget his fucking name. But... Real power is something you take. Name, but he just looked like an old oh, bitter son actor of a bitch. Guy. I can't remember him. Yeah, he's a dead. He's dead. Oh, there, oh, it's the picture. You make a puzzle with the We're back make cards. A puzzle. Yo, this is my boy. This is little Bobby. <laughs> Fucking, he was the voice of reason. He was the baby face of the goddamn family. Nice. Yo, she was fine. I forget. I, oh. think, it's, I think it's the one who waxed her. I can't believe they all have pictures. Some of the other cards have like information on the back, so it would tell the act. I can't believe they don't even they know don't who give they a are. Fuck. They, they don't just want care to put a they hand together. That's all the fuck they give it. I mean, can I be honest? This is the worst fucking playing cards ever. Here's a picture of the meeting. Cards. Here's a picture of them eating, they're just talking <laughs> to each other, and there's a piece of gum that is old wait, as wait. fuck. Mark Norman, eat the gum. I eat shit. No, and I'm like, dude, how is it? He's like, not good. I'm not like, good. yeah, it's from the freaking 80s, man. Oh, they got the gum. This yeah, is yeah. 80 year old gum here. Yeah, yeah. Can I grab one too? Can I? Yeah, I do. <laughs> oh, the card. And there it is. This is the eighth pairing of these two on the card. So you like Dallas for a couple years? For a couple years. And, then and I tell you, based on the fucking. These cards, never again. Oh shit, what <laughs> <I do? Take laughs> Oh shit, he doesn't want to be on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
James Mattern, you know, you, check on your like YouTube and, and hey, can I get you to sign one and give it back to yes, me? Sir. And then that'd be super cool. It'll just be a second. Yeah, pick whatever you want. Oh, the best. Go see, go see live comedy. James is so good. Oh, go so him. awesome. Right, you want these? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Take thanks, Super, Pop. thanks. Nice You're the best. Hey, so here's a 1974 Alexander Calder. It's called Tom's, and uh, you know these are a, This is called a stable, stable. And uh, you know uh, Marcel Duchamp uh, was the one who named his mobiles. But we're not here to talk about art. We're here for comedians opening cards. No coffee. It's just a ruckus show. Um, you're gonna see comedians you know. You're gonna see well, maybe a comedian you know, and maybe a comedian you don't know. Maybe a couple comedians you don't know. Well, you gotta wait and see. And they're gonna open cards and. Uh, we're gonna talk about the weird shows and the weird stuff that the cards uh, pertain to. Something about the past. And you're probably even watching this in the future. So, it's ruckus. Um, all of it's good. You're gonna love it. Um, you know, keep watching. There'll be things from me just doing stuff to make it more interesting to keep you guys watching. So like it, share it, comment below start some little discussions and freaking back and forth because that's what uh algorithmically makes it uh, more popular and then uh, i will be more uh, wanting to do more um i don't want to make money from this so ads that you see are not for me other than the fake ones that i'm going to put in for things because that's fun enjoy i just watched the most awesome improv show up in vermont and uh here's some people and here's the thing oh <laughs> I saw an even better one in Maine. The one in Vermont, I mean, it was okay. But the Maine improv show was like two times better than that one. We are Balderdash Academy. We'll go to Vermont, it doesn't matter. Oh yeah, we'll go anywhere. We, we serve New England. Uh, you can find us online at balderdashacademy.com. Yeah. So this is uh, Comedians Opening Cards No Coffee, and these are some improv comedians who are gonna open some cards. So what do you guys wanna pick? And say your name when you do it. Uh, this is Bob, and I think we should go Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves. Oh, hell yeah. Because it's permission to not be able to do accents. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just do your natural accent. It is Which is like, how I do improv. <laughs> yeah, it's like the Dick Van Dyke of cards. Full of sugar goes a long, long way. Have yourself a healthy open every day. Yeah. <laughs> you can't do accents. Because either. the one guy, the main star, didn't do his accent, Coster. but everyone else Kevin did. Kevin Coster. Yeah. Kevin Coster can only do Kevin Coster. I'd rather right. die and spend my life in hiding. Right, right, yeah. right. But so he's, done, he's done okay doing it. Morgan Freeman. Morgan Freeman, who is the reason why I learned how to read. What, whoa, whoa, what? what? Morgan Freeman, uh -huh. from in the 1970s, was the coolest man on television. He was the easy reader from Electric Company. Easy reader. Ah, top to bottom, left to right, reading stuff is out of sight. Oh, he is the reason why I learned. Now Cosby how to read. had a reading show, also. Uh, <laughs> yes, he did. I can't did. remember what that was called, but it you was know. drink this pudding and then tell me if you can uh, feel me. Picture pages, you. picture pages. Oh. Today's picture page. Oh, who's the answer? Christian Slater. Christian Slater. Oh, wow. Yeah. The benefit Hottie. of Christian Slater is, you know, he'll eventually ruin his own career. Um, <laughs> that, that's the benefit. Oh, no. The Kevin Costner. Kevin yeah. Costner. Yes, you're going to do one, too, if you made will. Made Marion Weapons of Glory. Weapons of Glory. Surprise you show Attack. Them, the nice thing about Surprise Attack is you get surprised, but if you find the right knot, you can find the tit pit of despair. Oh, nice, it's all the same movie. Nice. Pit of yes. Despair. This yeah. sounds like it's uh, like uh, what's that? Kevin Dark. Costner. Yeah. <laughs> Something else. American Robin Hood. Attack <laughs> from Above, which is the move I used in high school to get dates. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wouldn't admit to that. On that's the that internet. short. That's that Stop it short class, thing. Which is Stop it short. The move Steve used in high school to get dates. <laughs> <laughs> And the battle for Nottingham is what they the call move, prom right? night. Yes. <laughs> England at long last. That happened after the restraining order. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was the Reformation. And then <laughs> Weapons of Glory was my nickname. Lucky <laughs> you. Yeah. Oh, wow. yeah. You're it, still wearing some it of those. Was mostly, it was mostly marketing. <laughs> um, and Maid Marion denied my advances. <laughs> <laughs> There's the narrative of Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves. Awesome. And what was your name? My name is Bob. It's easy. It's a verb. 
B.O.B. flamed forward and backwards. Yeah, it's a palindrome. That is true. Unlike a palindrome, which just sounds stupid regardless which way you say it. <laughs> well, yeah, because she's like the it's not like Paul. congressperson or something, <laughs> well, senator from somewhere. She's a something. Palin. <laughs> I was thinking Michael Palin, but... Michael oh, Palin better. Yeah, 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 yeah. But see, that's brilliant either way you say it. Yeah. 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 He's the drug book oh, and he's the food Palin. guy. Yeah, <laughs> Python, yeah. Yeah. Oh, Michael Palin's the... Yeah. Oh, who... Oh, I was thinking of the... Who, who's the guy? Well, he's a presenter. Paul, too. there's another guy with a similar name. Yeah. Like, whatever, it doesn't matter. You're anyway, so what do you got? Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm going. And what with is your name? Steve of Balderdash Academy. Awesome. <laughs> I'm going with Batman Returns. Oh, that's a good one. Yes. Oh, Batman Returns. Who picked? Uh, Sam Sam Mor Morel Morel whatever picked that one too. Sweet. Yeah. So maybe you'll go on that show. Uh, like films, he's Dick done these, all these Christian ones. Yeah. 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 Oh, cool. Dick Tracy. Yeah. 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 Oh, oh Batman. Oh, this. Oh. Yes. Oh. I'm in. Sure. It's happening. <laughs> Sam, Sam, <laughs> Sam Morell. Steve's lying. How long have you been doing improv? I've been doing improv at least 10 years uh, nice. professionally. Uh, what a but great show. a lot show. longer as an amateur. Yeah. Awesome. All right. Do you guys tour all around? Sorry. We do, yeah. 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 Awesome. Yeah. Boulder right. Dash. Look at that nose. Okay, we're going with uh, the penguin right out the gate. Oh. Beautiful nose. Look at that. that Danny. That's, wow. that's my boy Danny. Danny. That's pretty good. Yeah. Danny that's boy. Good that's interesting. That's opinion. totally looks different than the others too, because they all have the red back. Like that's yeah, a that's like a, a special. Special. You got like a. I want that one back. Yeah. You, know, <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you give me twelve dollars, <laughs> <laughs> right, I paid got, for the show. <laughs> <laughs> we, okay, we got Catwoman, Michelle Pfeiffer. Oh, nice. Yeah. I think I watched this movie with my family on New Year's Eve when I was like nine. Yeah. I mean, it's that's like a good day to watch it. One of the ones we stayed up late for. But like, you didn't like, know who Pee Wee Herman was. No, oh. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's, it's okay. Back. It's, it's, okay. <laughs> I, I it's okay. Think, I think between Catwoman and the cat suit mm -hmm. and uh, Batman, that Batman, that this was the original sexual awakening movie uh, prior for a lot of to mm. the Mummy. Yeah. 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 No, for a lot the, of people. The TV show was the sexual. The TV awakening. show <laughs> for Batman. For Batman, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Pow! You, you want me to really date myself? That uh, Attack of the Clones for me. That was for. That was for you. Yep, that's it's how. Just... That's how young I am. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. There's a movie for everyone. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Still the hottest Catwoman. Oh yeah, you can you know. Yeah. Fight yeah. for. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Okay. Oh, though back in the Ooh, day, in that old kid. TV show, uh, what's her name? Old. Eartha Kitt. There was Julie Newmar. Yeah, there's two. Yeah. They'll yeah. kick Pfeiffer's ass. All right, rescuing the Ice Princess. I don't remember this scene from the film. All right. All right, well, we're done. <laughs> okay, next. Okay, she he doesn't remember. Forget it. Uh, it uh, acrobats in exactly. surprise in the clown's clutches. Oh, that's a good one. Look at that shot that's from the terrifying. film. terrifying. Yeah, that's freaky. That is scary. The clowns are crazy. Uh, okay, we got the penguin going ham on the crowd. A lot of, like, yeah, you can't show that kind of violence in a film anymore. Yes, you can. <laughs> <laughs> just opening fire on a crowd of people. You're yeah. the movies very much. Yeah. I think uh, you can just go on your phone and get back. Oh, uh, this was my nickname in, in high school. A giant surprise package. Oh! oh. Wow. <laughs> well. Yep. Was it a good surprise? <laughs> yeah. Or a like, bad consensual one? Surprise. <laughs> consensual surprise. Consensual surprise. And uh, like, Cemetery like Pilgrimage. Tabs. Oh, and last card, Sultan of the Sewers. <laughs> yeah, wow. baby. That could be a callback. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> but you guys you weren't there. I would listen to Sultan of the Sultan Sewers. Sultan of the Sewers. Yeah, that's a perfect punk band name. <laughs> well, thank you. Sultan this is a great Swank. Um, all right. Okay, you guys were all talking about your sexual awakenings. Mm. So I'm Dick getting... Tracy? No, no, it's not. <laughs> I'm Sesame going Street. Sesame Street. No, I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> Remember, I'm going Poker 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 Excellent. I'm Pocahontas. glad someone's finally opening Disney. Oh, yes, I'm Disney still. is. I'll talk to you later. Yeah, you don't want to do one? No, I'm. I'm it's all good. I know. It's late. Your even, shit. You were amazing tonight. Your child the show was proof, great. Mister. Good show, Dave. That's the point. Oh, yeah. Well, because they're for kids. Maybe I don't get to choose Pocahontas. I think there's drugs inside. I did inside. it. I did it. Well, I'm extra excited now. Drugs. Yeah, it's like a, it's, it's like a, you know, it says gummies. Okay. <laughs> the gum don't. All right. Yeah. 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 So, it's um. When we were discussing sexual awakening. Oh, John, you're a John Smith girl? Oh, John oh my gosh. John Smith, yeah. baby. Look at the way he Wait is tenderly looking into her eyes. Yeah, because she's 12. Well, we don't have to talk about that part. <laughs> I think she was. Oh, my gosh. What I could would give to be that tree. 
Wow, you like the, uh... Well, she's always looking for a hot piece of ash. <laughs> oh, wow, um, she but just you likes know a what? big piece also, of wood. That one loaded uh, up. You know what John Smith wasn't? Shirtless. Uh, who is he? Uh, isn't that Pocahontas? Oh, is okay. like, oh they, he like didn't the take, take his shirt off? The, oh, the like, Indian, I think this or is the one, Native American. Yeah, the that they wanted him to first get married to. First peoples, or the, uh... Um, first Nations. First Nations? Now, Kind of like a Snow White, except rolls reverse. No borders on these cards. No borders. No borders. There's no some borders. stuff on the no back. That's, that's, that was his line to her. No, no borders. borders. Yeah, yeah, you got stats oh, or something? Oh, there's, there's like little scene descriptions on the back of the cards. So this yeah. is their farewell, They don't apparently. describe the real life situation. Smith's only hope for survival is to Here sail back to Here I am, meeting Pocahontas. She's 12. Let me kidnap her and bring her back um, to my home. Don't country. worry about it. It's all good. Chief don't worry about Powhatan. it. Chief Powhatan. This guy's voice was like. What was his name? Uh, Chief Powhatan. 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 Yeah. Powhatan. Uh, well, I, I'm probably not saying that accurately. No, I know, but just but the hot in there seems odd. Powhatan. Powhatan. Uh, He's the oh, dad of the daughter. This is an interactive card, you guys. Oh yeah. You have instructions. Punch out figure, leaving figure attached at A. Fold card back so you can make him like stand up, and he can be like freestanding. That's how he gets to be so. Yeah. For hot. Um. I guess so. Something? I guess so. Um, this is a self-portrait. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, what are you talking about? That's terrible. You're more Pocahontas. Uh, oh, but look, look I've got the little, like, hair swoop and everything. <laughs> no borders. Um, we got a checklist A. Oh, the checklists are rare. Uh, and oh. then people, well, because every, okay. people who collected them, they would then mark them off and stuff uh, or not care about them. So often those are the more valuable cards of the collection of the uh, set. Uh, checklist Who cares? <laughs> and then we've just, you know, got a settler. We don't, yeah. we don't Oh, really. yeah. Boo! <laughs> but yeah, there's your Pocahontas cards. Colonists. Wow. And I'm going to be taking this John Smith one home. Yeah, you can have all of those and. But I'll give you the checklist because you said it was rare. Oh, wow. so oh look at that! Awesome checklist. And now oh, it's only can... checklist A, so they're yeah, like, we need more. We need more checklists. And C's. Awesome. So you guys are from Balderdash. Balderdash Academy. I'm Marie, Steve, Bob. You can find us on all of your favorite podcast services, yeah, doing yeah. funnies and, and making on YouTube. funnies. Yeah, and we laugh, and we like to try to make you laugh. Yeah. Yeah. We, let me, we make each other laugh. Go see live comedy, uh, improv, stand up, whatever it is. Just go see it. It's live. It's the best. There's nothing better. All right. Thank, thank, you. thank you so much. <laughs> Awesome. Good. Thank Thanks, you so Dave. 8.30 Mondays. Comedians. Opening cards. No coffee. Comedy. <laughs>